uh, Jordan Glasgow and Braden Smith ruled out for the game. And uh, Carson was uh, limited today. Um, we'll see how he responds over the next 48 hours. He'll, it'll likely be a game time uh, decision. He'll be listed questionable for all this group. Uh, we'll get in and talk with the docs and see, you know, see how he responded to today and determine how we're going to list him. Um, how do he look? Um, you know, in the limited reps, you know, he looked. I, I think he's gotten progressively better. So, um, you know, yeah, he looked okay. Uh, he has, it seems, made a lot of progress from Sunday because I know when we saw him, I mean, he was limping around pretty bad. Um, no, I'm, I'm very surprised we're even at this point, to be honest with you. I mean, because Monday and Tuesday was pretty bad. And I didn't think there, you know, Monday, Monday I thought zero chance. Tuesday, I thought there was a glimmer, glimmer of a hope. So, um, but we, you know, we've just handled it day by day. Like we said, you know, we've been pretty straightforward with how it's all come down and uh, pretty transparent. And it's been trying to figure it out. Trying to, and today was the next step in trying to figure that out. When was the first time you let it enter your mind that there's a chance, like realistic? And that, we're not there yet, but. Yeah, no, yeah, we're, no, we're not there yet. But I mean, you know, I think Wednesday, because well, what the conversation we had was when it got to be about Wednesday, like I just know in my mind, like, okay, if we're going to leave this open, then we have to think positively, okay? We can always go the other way, but you don't want to, be pessimistic about it and then say, oh, all of a sudden you're feeling better at the end of the week. Maybe you can go. So, you know, what Carson and I and everybody have talked about is let's just think as optimistically as we can and we can always back down and back away. So we've been very conservative. We, you know, Carson, you know, his health and is first and foremost. You know, we always take a long term approach. We don't want to do anything that will harm the player. And so, you know, he's done a very good job. Our training staff has been unbelievable, you know, during the week to make whatever progress we have made. And uh, so now we'll just have to see these last 48 hours how it plays out. Can, Frank, you, if, coach, if, can, oh, can, can you call a, a typical game? If he, if he is, I know this is hypothetical, but if he is able to go, can you call your typical game for Carson or will there have to be some concessions? Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm thinking through that right now. I mean, I don't know. I mean, uh, based on what I saw today, probably not. But, you know, we still got 48 hours. Um, and, you know, so and I don't even like I said, we got to see how today is and we got to decide if can, should we do that I mean is that right for the team if he can't function and play his game um, is what's best for what's best for him and what's best for the team and that's ultimately what will guide the decision if, if Carson does not play on Sunday will Jacob start yeah I'm not going to make those hypothetical it's a good question but and I understand the question but you know until you know our counter general will say well We'll make those decisions when we need to. We've thought through all the scenarios. We have a plan, you know, have a tentative plan in mind, and we'll address that when and if it's needed. With, 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 that, with that said, though, Frank, if, if you decide to go with, if Carson can't play, you go with Brett instead. How come Jacob has not been able to lock in that job, that job to be the guy? Jacob's, Jacob's, done a, Jacob's done a very good job. You know, I've got confidence in all of our guys here. I really do. Um, they're doing a good job. I think they're all getting better all the time. Jacob, Brett, um, you know, Sam's been hurt, but even Sam in the last couple of weeks as he started to back in rehab, uh, I think we got a pretty good situation. I, I confidence in all the guys. Frank, when, a when, couple more when uh, Carson came back from the surgery, it was like, okay, when he comes back, there won't be a fear of re-injuring because it would be healed. Is there a concern though, Sunday, that with this you can aggravate it? Yeah, no, yeah. It's, long, it's a longer term thing. I, well, I don't know if it's a longer term thing. You know, I'm not the medical expert on that, but you know, you're right, chap. I mean, we this is the kind of injury that you can reaggravate, and so um, all those things have to be considered.